Hello everybody, it's Stella here from Meeple University. I am joined by special guest today, uh, pretty much my neighbor, Jared from 3 Minute Board Games. Hello Jared, how are you? <laughs> uh, kia ora, kia ora, uh, Stella. Uh, neighbor, I mean there's 3,000 k's between us, so, so I, I guess we're about as close as, as anyone gets to but yeah <laughs> exactly exactly oh somebody subscribed rob thompson thank you so much rob for subscribing uh rob's also on the chat and yes i would consider um new zealand is our neighbor australia pretty much the same yes yeah like yeah international shipping should be about uh should be cancelled it should be just like <laughs> from me sending yeah. to tasmania that's pretty much the same right like me sending to the, it's the same distance Anyways, yeah. welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for joining okay. me. It's, it's such a pleasure to have you back here again, Jared. Yeah, and, no, sweet. Um, I know that you are, I don't usually do live streams, so I really appreciate that extra effort for coming here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's terrifying. I, I don't know how you put up with the stress of, of doing <laughs> stuff live. Like um, everything I do is scripted, regimented and organized. The idea of live content is freaking terrifying. <laughs> Thank you for your honesty, but I'm sure you have no issue. <laughs> I've seen you live before in my stream, so there's no issue there. But by the way, let's just um, introduce Jared a little bit more. So Jared is, well, you and Stephanie, right? But mainly you um, from yeah. three minute board games from mainly on YouTube. So just tell me yeah. about yourself. Well, where can people find you? What sort of things you do? Well, pretty much uh, if you're looking for a game and you want to find out anything about it in a short amount of time and you don't want it just to be someone doing a TikTok 50 second kind of, this is the game uh, sort of intro, th just look for the name of the game in three minutes yes. and you'll find us. We are three minute board games. We're really easy to find. We're really logical. And shockingly, our content is three and a bit minutes long. So <laughs> the recaps will be anywhere from three minutes zero to three minutes 59. <laughs> um so is that like yeah this is what you that's do. a rule yeah <laughs> yeah that's a that's a that's the rule there's one video that's like four minutes long and it annoys me because it, it's actually three minutes 59.2 oh. or or point six or something <laughs> but they rounded it up to four minutes and it's it's angered me ever since but, <laughs> i know yeah. i know i understand the feeling but do people complain i don't think i would care if it's the four minutes four minutes two seconds or whatever oh uh, some people are like oh three minutes 59 oh that, that's <laughs> it's not three minutes i'm like the videos are called about three minutes. You know, if someone, if you go, I'm going to be there in, in about three minutes and someone turns up at three minutes 59, you're like, you said about three minutes. It's three minutes, 59 seconds. You know, there are pedantic people out there yeah. who it doesn't matter what you do. They'll yeah. find some reason to get grumpy. It's true. It's, true. it's hilarious but for the, as well. Yeah. But for the most part, people appreciate the amount of information I can just shoot just cram into the time code. Yeah, um, I've seen And it. you normally get a pretty good overview of the game. Oh, yeah, very uh, good, why very I, good. Why I think you'd like it, what I think is really, really great about it, what might trip you up and make you not want the game. And something I do, which not a lot of other channels seem to do, and that's, you know, recommend other games that are similar or um, complementary. There so. you go. So check out Jared's channel, 3 Minute Board Games. Jared speaks really fast in the video, not in real life, just in the video. Um, no, I just speak pretty damn fast in real life. Okay, um, well. <laughs> yeah. no, but as if like you're not breathing in the video. Anyways, that is just the cut. Oh, no, I, I edit out all my breathing. <laughs> that's awesome. That's that's how I get it down to... That's why I'm not on screen. Like, <laughs> you're like, oh, why don't you appear on screen in the video? Because... I record something and then I will cut all the breaths, pauses, dramatic things <laughs> just, to, just to fit it in. And if I was on screen, it would be like, <laughs> I'd be all over the place. There you go. That's uh, amazing. That is the secret between three minutes board game, everybody, Jared. Thank you so much again for coming. Uh, and people yep. can find you on YouTube, um, you on, on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Yeah, but I barely do anything on those. <laughs> That's good. Twitter, maybe. No, not Twitch. Not Twitch. Twitter. Twitter, you probably. No, nah, not Twitch. Twitter, yeah. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah, I'm on Instagram, but I don't think I've put a picture up in four months. So, yes. you know. Okay, yeah. That's it's fine. not a great place to keep keep following what we're doing. That's all right. We're, we're YouTube. YouTube's where, where we sit. There you go. Well, um, I'm also saying hello. We've got uh, a pretty busy chat here from Travis. Hello, uh, Rachel from also from Australia and Coral Lou. Hello, hello. Uh, Mr. Corsa Wand, uh, where's Mrs. Corsa? Mr. 
what where is mrs costa mr costa uh and then there's rob uh, gonna be perfect stream thank you so much tom uh play concordia once really enjoy it hope digital version implementation is good casey mm. kingfisher games uh, how about it? uh rob uh, rini is here everyone's here uh tom i did say that sorry if i miss any anyone um yes and we are uh, also this time which is quite unusual we have two steam key to give away for everybody so we're going Ooh. to um let everybody enter shortly um i'll let you know how and then we will draw this at the end of our live playthrough thanks for akram digital for providing the stream key uh now we are i'm going to take you to the actual game so you can see the layout of concordia digital now um if anyone here in the chat have not played concordia board game please let us know i assume that a lot of people actually have played it i know me i've played it a few times jared you played it like it's one of your favorite games i believe no i, I like it but i think i've played it approximately like four times in person yep yep there you go yeah all right so i think and that was primarily for testing i haven't played it since we reviewed it shoo, probably this time last year mm -hmm. uh, i played a couple of the games of the digital digital version to remember how the hell it worked um but i'm i'm as i've said i am trash at this game i've never won it <laughs> it's one of those games like chinatown or power grid that i like but i am just i'm just trash at mm, so we'll we shall see. see we'll see we'll see <laughs> we'll but see. this is not about winning right this is not about winning um so, tom hey do we need to watch the video oh, at half a speed then uh <laughs> All only right. if you are slow uh, <laughs> all right so we're gonna tell you how to enter the giveaway after i give you a quick overview or jared you wanna i'll do i'll give you a quick overview because this is actually um you can see this is my point of view and jared is concordia one in red and um stella yeah. mu <laughs> i didn't actually register a, an account for this game to play online <laughs> until two minutes ago so that was the first thing i put in so. concordia one great very creative uh yes yeah, so this is concordia uh <clears throat> the i this is kind of like a civilization building where you play your cards it's as simple as you play one of your cards do the action that stays in the card and then until you play a card that picks up all your cards and the game continues so you want to get your oh look at the background oh my gosh sorry i got so distracted so easily oh. <laughs> She's awake. Hi, Anne. She's awake. Hello. She's had a big day at the hospital today. Oh, so um, And everybody. So she's. she's yes. Hey. Hello, Steph. That's Steph. Yes. Stella says hi. She, she can't hear you because yeah. I've got the yeah, headphones yeah, yeah, on. Yeah, that's okay. Um, yeah, so Anne had um, heart surgery when she was only about three months, three and a bit months old. Mm -hmm. And she was just having a checkup, and everything is hunky dory. Oh. And she's just a very, very keen person in fact she's just looking around going what is all this oh the internet you? hello <laughs> and internet say hi to n everybody say hi hello it's so cute hello hi. no definitely definitely the style of this show now that's it this is it um i'm playing again <laughs> and I'll, I'll let her win and that's that's that <laughs> all right oh. probably won't keep her here for too long bye hi hi oh hi. come back <laughs> come back Oh, okay okay bye. yeah she's 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 such a sweet wee thing so as well sweet. she's just got such a really great temperament she's yeah she's chill she likes people she's really attentive she's yeah she's awesome so just like you right jared yeah mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> <laughs> um cheeky she, she does look like you a little bit though oh she does yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah especially if you see baby pic baby photos of me she looks a hell of a lot like me oh wow you should share it one day. It'll be interesting. <laughs> um, anyway, this is, yes. And it's one of the reasons why the channel has not been doing two videos a week this year. Um, I've, I've been still managing to put out one video uh, most weeks, but yeah. That's understandable. <laughs> she's taking, she's taking understandable. A bit of time. understandable. That's okay. Uh, Mr. Costa said, good to 
uh, he she's doing well. All right, so yeah. I'll continue. Uh, Hannah say I really like Concordia and waited for the solo for so long. Now I don't know if I should get solo or playing digital. I usually prefer offline. There you go. So it is. Yes, you can play solo against AI, which we are going not to not going to do today. We're just gonna play two players Concordia using the smaller map. So probably a little bit better than the bigger map. We'll see. Uh, so yes, uh, what you wanna do? You wanna you know you have your uh, colony colonist sorry uh the soldier and the ship so you will travel around and then build your house and you're trying to get points based on the cards you have which is uh, on your hands and also the cards you can purchase so that's all tied together now um, you can always go to the top left to see everyone's the summary of everyone's you know uh, position or the life points. So this you can turn on and off to see how many points you have at that time. So that's really cool. Um, and then that's pretty much it. You build all the things. You are getting points from expanding your civilization. You get points from the goods you produce you have. You get money, you can sell. And the game end triggers um, if one person build all of their 15 houses or um, the cards supply, the cell supply is gone. Is there any other end game condition, Joe? Um, not that I can remember. I just, yeah. I just know that one of the things that trips up new players is the scoring system. Yes. Uh, that it's based on these cards, and if you lose track of that, you can like build a whole bunch of things and score very, very few points. Yeah, um, yeah. So you can and my urge is just to build lots of things and not get the cards, which is why I keep losing. <laughs> Well, if you look at the top left, uh, there's like the people icon and then to the right of it is where you keep track of your points, which is good. So some people like it, some people don't. That's why at the start of the game, you can choose to turn off that feature if you don't want to, which is great. Um, so uh, with that, that is, you know, that's definitely not as good as three minutes explanation, but that will do for now while we do our turns. Uh, yeah. So N20 games. Oh yeah, Carl. Hey Carl. Uh, I'm not good at games like this either, but they're still fun to play. Now, before we start, I'm the first player. I'm gonna tell everyone how to enter. By the way, so this is it. Uh, you see the screen. If you are used to our giveaway, this is what you do. It. So this is a worldwide giveaway. You go to mipleuniversity.com slash giveaway, and the password is Jared. Ah, so <laughs> it's J A R R O D. Thank you, Jared. Uh, all in capital. So once you put the password in, a form will appear, and then you just fill up a simple form, and we'll um, draw this at the end of the live playthrough with the the cage thing, like the bingo thing. Uh, you'll see. You'll see later. Uh, so mm -hmm. go ahead and enter. Now, I am the first turn, uh, the first player. Mm -hmm. I will play. I usually start like to start my game with the architect for some reason uh i haven't thought about where i'm going yet but i'll mm. just go just go probably what i can afford i'm just looking for a place that i can actually afford maybe so i'm gonna click on my colonies i have two movement it actually says as you can see in the map and you just move to the place that you want to build so for example i want to go here and i will click that all my movement so i click tick to end my movement now i have to select the city cities that i want to try to build um thing so for example like that sorry jerry jerry can't really see this because the other player can see it once i'm done so i'm gonna go actually go back um uh, demonstrate so i can actually go back as well so that's there's a like taxi backsy button like oh yeah okay no i'm not gonna do that which i'm not gonna do actually i'm actually going to go to let's see here maybe so i want to be able to build somewhere sorry this is like taking too much okay Come on, Stella, quick. Okay, here, let's go here, let's go here. Yes, I can, I can do this. All right, click, and then I can click this one, and then click this one. So it shows two building, I can click tick, and it'll build two building there. And that's basically what I can do in my architect turn. I hit tick, now Jared can see what yeah, I've done. Yeah, it's, um, yeah, 
So we pop through. Yeah. So you've popped through and mm-hmm. Oh, that's that's a pretty good opening play. Oh thank you. Oh cheers to that. <laughs> yeah, no, not bad, not bad. Not oh, bad. You. Now I've got no idea what the hell I'm doing. That's um, okay. Now I will in the meantime I will check make sure everybody is okay with entering the giveaway. So uh checking that yep. I've got emails. Yes I do. Okay, good. Okay, so I'm going to, um, what am I going to do? I'm probably going to Merc until on my first turn. Um, Oh, nice. So I'm going to sell that wine um, because I don't think I can get good use out of it. I'm going to buy myself some bricks. I wonder if I should share your screen, Jared. Oh, no, that's okay. I can Uh, see what you've done. Yeah, mm-hmm. I'll, I'll I'll be I'll play pretty quick. I'm not not a slow player, so no, no, no. I'm you not can do saying more... that you can. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, no, I'm saying you can do you can do more of the explaining all when it flicks back to you. While it's with me, I mean, I'll just I'll just go through my turns pretty quick. Okay, okay, okay. Whew, the pressure. All right. Um, selling seems to be a good turn. I have zero. I really need money, but I probably will try to get some goods first before selling. So let's see if I. If you want to see, you want to get the game to calculate what you do, you can just click the card like Prefect, for example. Now, with Prefect, you can tick on it and you can choose this. And it actually calculates how much money you get. That's zero. Not, nothing's been done. So, produce on active province. And then it tells you what I'll get where. So, it looks like this is a, you can see on the screen, this is the most profitable one. So, I'm going to tick yes. And green, t- and that's it. That's yeah. my turn. Cool. Mm-hmm. Um, now I've got some resources. I will architect. I'm going to take my dude, move him over to this place, and then I'm going to build in these two things. So that's my turn. I moved um, my guy into that area, and I built in a cloth place and a uh, farm. Fantastic. So uh, in the chat, people say October tomorrow. Amazing. Well, uh, we are October here, me and Jared. So, and look oh, yeah. like the world still around. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah it's f- first of October. Uh, looks like the world is still around October. FYI from the future. Uh, so. It's actually a lo- lovely day here. Like it's, it's a beautiful, clear blue sky. And oh, nice. not that you can see it because I'm in a dark, dingy room. But um, <laughs> you, you have to trust me that it's, it's quite nice outside. I, I trust you. Is it in lockdown <laughs> in New Zealand still at the moment? It's kind of weird. So Auckland, which is the main city up up the top of the North Island, where most of the ports and all that kind of stuff is, is in what we call a level three lockdown, which is uh, reasonably severe. Mm-hmm. Um, you can still go to work. Um, if you can work from home, you should. Uh, masks mandatory, uh, that kind of, of deal. And... You know, you, you're not really eating in restaurants. You can pick up food, but you can't um, do stuff. The rest of the country is in a level two, which for all intents and purposes is basically normal living, except that public gatherings and uh, entertainment venues have to have more spacing mm-hmm. and masks, except when you're eating. So okay, it's, all right. it's not too bad. I'm just using it, I'm using it personally as an excuse to work from home. That is good. That's um, what I'm good thing about it. Yeah, so it means that I've spent our entirety of this this last lockdown um, at home with Steph and Anne, and it's like, I yeah, know, right? I'll do that. <laughs> it's like, yeah, that's true. Silver lining. Oh, that is so good. Yeah, you can always find the silver lining um, in this one, which is good. I'm also in lockdown. I haven't seen my friends for ages, but then I'm also in my moon boot. Um, that's my silver lining. I can't go anywhere anyway. Yeah. It's like, okay, that's all good. Yeah, well, that's, uh, that's harsh on what we've got here because at uh, level two, mm-hmm. we still have our weekly um, D&D games and tabletop games and stuff. So mm-hmm. we're still being able to get around to people's houses. Yeah, uh, yeah. It's just you, you couldn't have a convention right now, but you, you can have like five people playing a board game. Okay, yeah, that's, that's not too bad. So that, that we're how we are. I don't know where, um, how everyone else in the world is going. I think we're just a little bit different here in Australia and New Zealand. Um, yeah. the okay, Mr. Costa said the one negative I've heard with it is multiple players. You need one copy, is I believe, yes, you need one copy for 
each player to have this digital to play online. Uh, I yeah. I'm not. Don't quote me on that. I think you do that. You need that. Um, otherwise. Yeah. But that's pretty normal for digital implementations. Correct, it's, yeah. it's actually reasonably generous um, for a digital implementation not to do that. Yeah. Uh, I can't actually think of any that do that off the top of my head. I'm sure there are some. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're, we're like the, the GM or DM can host a game and anyone yeah. else can come in. But Yeah, yeah. It's You're right. Like, uh, well, I'm a Jackbox, East, but Jackbox, Jackbox is very oh, different. Yeah, yeah that's, that's it. Yeah. And you don't yeah. need the actual thing. You also, you just need to log in the computer. So it's, it's, it's yeah. not the same. Um, all right. Anyway, this is actually apparently my turn. <laughs> it's my turn. It's now or never. I'm going to play the Mercator. La 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 la. It rhymes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm not a good singer, but at least it rhymes. All right. I'm going to play the Mercator. 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 Um, and then now I'm going to start selling. Um, yeah. I'm going to re let's see where I am. Where can I build right now? Oh, that's Jared. It's very close to me. Hello. Hey. <laughs> I can move here. Okay. All right. This is what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to sell this wine, sell, sell, sell for 12, and then I'm going to buy, what do I sell, what do I have, what, what do I need, if I go here, I'm going to get, um, I might need, all right, I need, I need to buy brick, let's buy some brick, buy, yeah. brick is always good. And that's it. That's me done. Okay. So. Uh, uh, Rachel, every day is a musical in my house. That's awesome. Sometimes here as well. We just sing like every single, like different things would trigger a musical in our heads usually. Uh, it's a live play with Stella. You never know what could happen. That's correct. <laughs> that is correct. Uh, and we've got 13 entries. Excellent. So while Jared is thinking, I want to uh, yep. so oh, you've done. Yep. My move was just to use the um, prefect. Yep. Uh, and because I've got the bonus thing, I used it in a territory I don't have any influence in mm -hmm. uh, to get two cloth. Yeah. I'm actually, um, I forgot about it. I should have probably looked at the cards earlier and then purchased the thing better. So oh, yeah. I'm going to the cards i know let's have a look at the cards <laughs> right uh so the good thing is you can open the display while opening the the point scoring on the left hand side so you can compare like what you want to get what you know how much score you get and that sort of thing i do like the look of this but i also want to build soon i do want to build somewhere um in here okay i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna still do that i'm gonna see where is my oh i can get prefect what did jared play like last time prefect so i can copy jared's prefect yeah. i'm not going to do that i'm going to do senator so play senator click ok and then now it tells me so the one that you cannot afford is grayed out you can see i don't have wine so this cost is grayed out that's good so i want to try to get this one um that is the colonist uh, action, but it's more powerful than the yep. normal one. And then uh, this one is probably I'll get. Ooh, diplomat is good. Okay, I definitely changed my definitely changed my strategy here. So I'm gonna get those two cards, and then I will need to pay. Select one to pay. Okay, I'm gonna pay this and this okay sorry all right this one yeah well good okay, i'll figure it out thank you and <laughs> sorry all right senator um, colonist and diplomat crikey what house what have we got here um yeah i've yeah. got I purchased okay. some and you can see my points it's different now um See what type of cards I have immediately rather than 
like surprise at the end of the game. It's sort of, well, yeah. not really, but. Oh, yeah, I might follow up on that. And because I, I never remember to do these things. So That's okay. I might and get that one. Everybody, don't forget to enter the giveaway. I will draw two Steam keys available at the end of this live playthrough. And the password is Jared. Ooh, fantastic. Fantastical. All right. I can play Colonist again if I want to. So. Let me click. Oh, yeah, that's. Um, I did a boo boo. Oh, this is not the one that I want. Damn it! I was actually wanting the architect one I got. Maybe. What'd you get? <laughs> uh, architect and farmer. Yeah, architect. Oh my gosh! That's okay. That's okay. Um, right. Let's see what I can get with prefect. Not much. So what I'll do because of my boo boo, I will actually. Oh, I can buy more of these. No, I can't afford to get. I think I'm unfortunately I probably need to pick up stuff. Because of my mistake, I'm just gonna do that. I'm not gonna think too much, and that's it. Okay. Yep. Done. All right, Tribune, pick stuff up. Boop, boop. Mm -hmm. uh, my turn's going to be pretty straightforward. I'm just going to prefect. I'm going to prefect from this area where I get two cloth. Mm. You haven't picked up your thing yet. Nope. Mm -hmm. I do want to do prefect as well. Again. But I only get four coins and that's not great. But that's okay. I'm just going to do that. That's it. Nice and easy. Oh, forgot to hit the click. There you go. The hit. Thick. Oh, did you flip? Yeah. Did you do a... Desperate. Oh, okay. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because that gives me the option of doing this, which is to diplomat off your prefect. Mm hmm and get another two cloth. Well done. Well done. Now I want to get more stuff. I'm going to do prefect again. And it's most profitable if I activate this one. So I'm going to do that. And I'm with you again. Coralu, I just scrapped yeah. back and saw baby Anne. She's so adorable. Aww. <laughs> uh, Kevin Tasa. Okay, sorry. S. Chiang, um, me too. I'm also out of work since mid May as my government forced lockdown my workplace. No. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. Uh, Kevin asks if is this game played over X rounds? How do you win by having the most FVP? So it's end game trigger. Uh, yes, the most VP. Is the winner but end game trigger is if this uh cards in the market depleted or somebody built the first 15 houses so at the moment um i've got two jared has got two houses built yeah and uh i'm just doing a real basic pick up my hand yep wow that's good last longer than me so that is always it's always good all right, I'm going to see if I can do my architect now, which is the one that I meant to have. So I will go to... Uh, oh, no, I don't have that. Maybe I should do a... No, you know what? I'm going to do Mercator first because I need some money. Oh, yeah, the colonists give me money too. Okay, I'll get Mercator first though. Alright. 
I will buy, uh, sell this uh, lots of wine. I'm the wine seller. Yep. And then I will buy, let's see what I need. I will probably buy, so one, two. Okay. I'll buy the anvil. Is it what you call it? Anvil? Anvil. Yeah, it's an anvil. I, I think of it as, as as metal or or iron. Yeah. I think iron would be the resource. Iron, yeah. And automatically, you can see at the bottom of the screen, it's grayed out a little bit, but you can see it's added. So you can like it occupies this much space of yours or something like that. And that's it. That's me done. Okay. Hi, yep, giggles, giggles. Getting money is never a bad strategy. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm yeah. confident in that now. Uh, I'm going to be doing Mercator as well. Mm -hmm. I'm going to sell a bunch of stuff. That sounds and I'm terrific. going to buy a bunch more. Check. One, Kevin two, asks, three, four. Is there any sort of deck building in this game or is more like action selection game? Uh, it is more action selection game. You kind of like build your deck, but you have full choice of what you want to play rather than random from your deck. Yeah. Um, and it's not automatic to get all your cards back. You have to play a card to pick up all your cards. Wow. Money, money, money. Lots yeah. of food there. Mr. Jarrett. Uh, yep. Yeah. Architect it is now. Time for Architect. I will move my to yeah yeah oh. to here and then I will build in these two cities da da done yep as young is expecting my third child in 10 days time woo you you'll be home for for it. That's awesome. A third one. All right, I'm going to be moving my fleet. Um, I'm then going to be building. Um, in two places. Ooh. Very good. Where are you? You do that one. Okay. That is that's a really good move. Um, I think I need to buy some stuff. I can't. What do I want to do? Do I want to? Diplomat Jarrett's architect uh, for one misleading thing. Maybe I should do that. Maybe it's worth it. Okay, let's see. So if I play Diplomat, there's a card I can choose. Obviously, you can't Diplomat a Diplomat. Um, I will click this guy over here and then... Oh, girl or whoever. They, them. And I will move... I can build a city here right now. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, unfortunately, that's the only place I can build but set me up for maybe a good thing for next so I'm gonna move there I'm gonna build there and hit yes and that's it where'd you go mm. yeah getting apart the big from, ones yeah. apart from the yeah. tiny house I like the look of a digital <laughs> it's tiny <laughs> maybe because look it's it, look look it's bigger that that's probably the zoom in I can as much as I zoom in I can do I can zoom out, um, and then that's the point at the moment. So I tally up the current point right now, on, and obviously that's not final. And that's again, that's where my points came from, okay. basically. Just really, really handy. I'm going to oh. take the senator action, and I'm just going to grab a couple of cards. I I am pretty dry. As you can see what I've got there. I don't have a lot, and I think I will need to. <laughs> oh gosh, do I need to pick up cards? The so Tribune is 
I can't afford to buy anything. I can't afford to do colonies. So Tribune is the only thing I do. I can't even okay. play colonies, which is really sad. I'm just thinking about it now. Just putting all the cards in. And that's it. All right. Mm -hmm. um, hey, Ella from Facebook. Hello, Ella. To my favorite content creators. Hey. Hey. Hey, Ella. Uh, Ella's played this one as well, as well. I think. Pretty sure. She's done what? She's done. Uh, she's played Concordia Digital as well. She likes this game. Oh, okay, yeah, cool. Pretty sure. Right, I'm just having a good think That's about okay. what I want to do. It's your I'm turn. To <clears throat> Let me just like lower the note. It's your it's turn. My life. <laughs> it's your turn. <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs> it's your turn. It's no on now or never. <laughs> Are you gonna play the Mercator? Or are you gonna you admit know. defeat? <laughs> Yo. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out which <laughs> zo okay. zone I'm trying to build in. Where is it? Yeah. There it is. And this is the password everybody Oh, has. it's that one! What? Okay. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's that one. So that's how you enter. Prefix. It's in, on the screen. NippleUniversity.com, the giveaway password is Jared Owen Capital. Ooh, 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 that's good. That is very good, Jared. What can I do here for prefixing? You haven't flipped it yet. How can you not flip it? <laughs> so sad. Okay. I'm desperately did stuff, so I'm gonna do that. Okay. It is. Mr. Costa, Stella got the yeah. musical strategy going. Has it worked? I don't think it worked. <laughs> I don't think it worked, sorry. Um, can't you get money from the colonists? That's right, I forgot. <laughs> you are correct. I can get money from colonists. Take five plus one per colonist. All right. All right. I really need to do some exchange again. So I will need to get, oh, sorry, I need to sell this for some money. And then I need to buy, actually, wait a minute. Oh yeah, I need money. Damn. Sell. <laughs> uh, is not swearing in Australia at all. That's like part of language. And I think I'll buy this one this time. Let me see. Is it the way Sean on board? <sighs> or not? Ah, yep. That's kind of done. No. <laughs> it sounds bad. Um, actually, I will keep um keep one of these. I'm gonna sell two and keep one. Oh. And then I will buy uh, this thing. Let's do. Ooh. Okay, that's it. Um, hang on, is that it? done? Uh, just one good you want to. Oh, what is? Wasn't it working? What's uh, hmm? not working? There's something is. What's not working? I'm not working. Okay, let me just like rewind because I have to keep track. All right, make it all. Yes. And then that sell to pieces. Okay. And then buy this. That. There you go. Done. Done. Thank you very cool. much. Uh, all right. That's a question, I think. <laughs> Hashtag team distraction. Uh, can the icons okay. for resources needed to build cities be turned off? It looks like a little busy in comparison to the board game version. Um, I don't know, actually. I don't know. Uh, yeah, there might be an option in there. Yeah, but I there haven't actually go. tried. I do like the fact that it actually tells me that. But I th I'm guessing there should be an option um, to do that. Let's see, go to here. 
options. Um, there's color, even there's color blind mode. This, yeah, I can't see anything here. Maybe there's going to be another one somewhere else. But this is my turn. So, I'm going to play this. And I am going to play a new colonist. My cities. And I will play a colonist in here. And then I'm going to also play a colonist in... Yeah, I haven't even moved the boats yet ever. Like, man. Yeah. yeah, this this one looks like ground troops are better than boats. Oh uh, yeah. All right. Yeah, okay, I'm playing just Hi, this. Hi Ryan. A uh, question from Rachel: Are you going to Australia's largest board game night in Biogemology? No, I don't know that there is one. It's an online event. Three. Yeah. 2 8 p.m. Friday, 1st of October in Melbourne. It sounds great. It does sound great. Um, so it is so Friday. Rachel is in Australia. Okay, so it's Friday. That means it's today. But I'm planning to work today, tonight. I got some <laughs> last minute video to do. Um, but I'll, I'll take it. Um, I do. Actually, I am streaming. Welcome to live this Saturday morning Australia time as part of Melbourne International Gaming Week. I suspect that's probably what why Gameology, which is a board game store in Australia, does that too, part of Melbourne International Gaming Week. So this Saturday at 10 a.m. Melbourne time, I am uh, live streaming. Welcome to it's a live play along, so everyone can you know grab their sheet. Or well, uh, welcome sheet. to the the roll and write, the flip and write, the roll and write. Oh, there is roll and write. Yeah, Flip and right. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yep. The flip and right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yay! Uh, yes, part game, of it. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Yes, part of it. All right. So it is my turn. I have not thought of my woman or the do. I think I am going to <laughs> see what I can get. Have you flipped anything, Jared? I don't think you have flipped anything. Uh, I can get eight coins, but that's no. not good enough. I can get, I can do architects again, but I don't have enough. I can, I don't want to do three boons. That's too quick. I can copy Jared, but it's not going to be that good for me. So I think I'll just going to do prefect again, which is yeah. not the best, but it's probably, I'm going to see. All right. So looking at that list that I've just popped up in the screen, best to just get the money and mm, that's it oh why why am I in this predicament again yes I'm gonna do that get money and done du -du -du. Hannah our damn time zone I would like the play along yeah it's so what is that um <laughs> it's Friday evening in US Canada time Oh, sorry, I haven't. Thick, thick. All right, that's that. Sometimes that's I, I forget. Okay, I think. Okay, thick, thick, you thick, flipped. Thick. Cool. Yeah. All right, Flippy, I'm thick. going to try something I don't really do very much. Oh. I don't think I've ever done this. How exciting! Uh, yeah. Um. Just wondering where we put the second one. Can we put, we put them both there? Nope, I just need to undo something. There we go. That's a good thing about it. You uh, can just undo da, 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 da. <laughs> I used um thingy to place down two new dudes. Oh, very good. It sounds like a very good turn. Yep. Oh, I forgot to press enter. See? Yeah, the thing was right. <laughs> <laughs> well, it made like a big dramatic flourish when I placed them. I was like, oh, that must be the intent. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so if I want to see what Jared's playing, I can just click the diplomat and then look at that. Ooh, Jared's colonist is good. There's actually a good shortcut for that. You can actually see um, by your name in the circle the card that the person last played. Yes, but then can you actually see what card that is? Like, does it give you explanation of what it does? 
No, nah, it just it just reminds you of the symbol. Yeah, if, but if you it's could, a good little reminder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's actually really good that, but I often forget what is that symbol mean. So, but yeah, it's a good reminder when you are good like Jared. Uh, flat new colonies on your new city, each for blah blah blah, or take money. I like the like um. I like the looks of that, so I'm gonna just take money. There you go. It's probably not good enough, but meh, we'll see. Okay. Okay. How many will these get? One, two, three. Yeah, that's probably not a bad turn. Coral last welcome too. I'm yes, just kidding. Hmm? Ah! Three work. Yay! Hooray! I need those bricks as well. Um. Oh, I have a second diplomat. I forgot I've got a second diplomat. If I do this, I only get one brick, which is the that is yeah. not good. If I do senator, I can't buy anything. If I do architect, well, I can do measly one. So I'm gonna just three unit stuff that. I didn't even use the architects or that. Done. So my turn's going to be shockingly the same. Hi, Henry's. Henry's here. Oh. I'm also tribuning. Okay. Hey, the niche shelf is here. Hello. Michael. I assume Michael, otherwise, it will be Judy at the niche shelf. All right. All right. Jared is at 59. I'm at 42, everybody. Just FYI. Jared is clearly winning. I would like. Let me just see what I can do if I get the prefect again. Because it should be good. Ah, look at that. I will do prefect. Thank you so much, everybody. And that is it. Okay. Okay. Mm. Um. You can see that if you click on the card while Jared's turn, um, you can see the description at the bottom. Just having a bit of a think. That's okay. Hmm. How do I maximize this? That is not good yet. Or if I go probably I could go there. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do no, that's not particularly great. Mm -hmm. ah! <laughs> I I totally understand you. The frustration. So I think it is yeah. Metrox. Metro X. I want to play Metro X as well again. I think that's I think I have played it. Is that the um uh, the clown symbol publisher game right? Clown symbol, I think it's clown symbol. Ooh. The net shelf. Can you go over the rules again? No. It's the hand say no. No. Well, um, the rule is that you can't ask for the rules explanation again. That is the rules. Uh, oh, I'm sure the net shelf knows how to play it. This is, this is already the second playthrough. All right, this is my turn. Yep. I am going to try to buy some cards at the moment. Well, it's still available. I'm going to buy this. And I'm also going to buy. It's all grayed out. It's not good. Oh, this is probably good, but it's expensive. And I might do this one. It seems to be doing a lot of these things, so I'm going to do that, get that. And then to pay the cost, I will pay with. This one. Okay, done. Yep, cool. Mm -hmm. Yep. Good cards. Uh, I'm going to architect. Mm. And let me see where I can go. Hey, godly god. That one. Three ones here. And I think I can do this if one. If you want to enter the password, this is how you enter. 
two steam keys giveaway let me just see so we've got 23 entries 23 entries and then we draw two winner to win one steam key each well done jared there we go thank you very much i will now do a mechator dun, 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 dun. i will buy this now where am i here if I want to go here, that means I need to get that. Okay. Let's say I got this much. And then I will also buy this. I don't need to sell this time, I think. It should be good. And that's it. I haven't actually thought about it that well, but yeah, we'll see what happens. Um... Okay. I think that meant two prizes, one each pair to winner. So yes, two winners. So one winner will get one steam key each. So we'll get two winners. Lol, what Stella said. <laughs> Ooh, prefect. Ooh. Yeah. Mm. Now I've got the prefect thingy. I do like the look of doing a bit of architecting at the moment. So... Dinner chef, I think Concordia is my favorite again. I just can't win ever. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's that's me too. I would like to move this person over to where is my other guy? Uh, yeah, and then why is it that thing pop up? Anyways, my other guy is in Rome, just chilling. So I'm just going chilling. to just chilling, yeah, it's definitely. And I get it to move to probably here. And now it's building space. Build. Oh, no, not not yet. This one. Come on. This one. This one. This one. And this one. Four buildings in one tap. Thank you very much. Nice. Yay. <laughs> All right. Uh, hi, Brad. Nicely Brad. done. He looks fun. Yes. Hey, Travis. Is it the same Travis as the first one? Or is it different Travis? Love it. Uh, welcome to Technically a Flip and Ride. Uh, I am just... Oh, I have to scroll down. Like I'm just selling some, selling some stuff, buying some stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, Hannah, thank you, Stella. It's quite something reading the chat and playing at the same time. I have to sacrifice something. Yeah. We'll see. <laughs> Winning the games, so 1990s. All right. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I think it's time to do this. Dun dun dun. And I will have to put in Rome a, a bot. How do I take bot? Is it it? Yes. Done. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get a boat. Get a boat. I'm on a boat. Yeah. To Rome, at Rome. But uh, to my boats, I just dock at Rome and doesn't really do anything, unfortunately. Um, yeah, like bo boats are not great on this map. I know. From what I can, it's not a lot of from what I can gather. Yeah, I can I can go there eventually. Hopefully, maybe, maybe not. How do you get the boat from on the outside? Oh, you have to build your boat on the top of the thing. That's right. Forgot about yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. Lol. Uh, winning the game is so 1990s yep. so 1900s playing and not flipping the table over is so now lol <laughs> missed the coaster <laughs> one 2021 that's a quote uh Oof. Asked, strong move oh, 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 oh very good uh rob ask um stella and jared how do you rate the concordia digital implementation on scale one to ten oh uh, uh, jared when, when i do the, my turn uh, I hate doing scaling numbers. Um, 
I would say it's one of the better implementations I've played. It's it's all pretty laid out well. Um, I don't know if it's quite as sexy as some of the things like the Twilight Struggle implementation, um, but it's definitely in, in a top tier sort of really, really good implementation of a game. Um, yeah, so if I, was, if I was rating it out of 10, eight or nine, I'll, it'd be interesting to see once it gets all of the extra, like, bits and bobs that Concordia's got, because it's only coming out with, um, you know, the core game. They are planning on putting the other bits and bobs in. But it's nice and simple, which is probably what you want for this game. It doesn't have, like, the flashy animations of Root Digital or something like that. So, yeah, pretty good. There you go. That is the answer. Uh, well, I'm thinking about what I'm going to do. <laughs> Thanks, Jared. Uh, all right, I think I'm going to just do... Um, I'm going to do Prefect. I can't do... I can't copy Jared's architect because, well, I've got no nothing whatsoever. So Prefect is probably... Prefect is the perfect card to play. How's that? Mm -hmm. All right. Now, uh, this, these are my options. As you can see, I think I am wanting to build... Well, it depends on where I'm going to build, really. Like here or here or i should probably use my boat somehow i can also go to here and build something there okay i'm gonna just do this one then sweet there you go oh, yeah. yeah i don't play a lot of digital implementation a lot but um what's the other one that i've played i feel like i have played hero Star Realm, Hero Realms. That's also that's also I am. really good. Yeah. Um, I'm buying Hero or Star Star Realms. Uh, I have uh, Hero because that's that was Kickstarter and they had that beta thing. I think Star has okay. been a while for a while. I think and they just brought up or will bring out the the full version of Heroes. Um, what else have I? Mm. I don't know what I else I've played, but I play. I think this. Is, I'm probably biased because I like Concordia, so this is, I think, it is, um, it helps with, okay, it, honestly, it takes time for your first game to get used to where everything is. I was like, yeah. where's every, well, hang on, where's that list where you can, where you know what you get when you do prefect? Oh, there's none. It's actually all over the board. So things like that, for example, get used to it. But once you know what's going on, then that's, that's yeah, really good. yeah, yeah. All right, um, I am going to play Michaela again. Pro oh, actually, Jared's doing that. Can I get this one? I cannot. I have to play prefect yeah. again. All right, let's let's do that. Prefect. Back, 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 back. All right. If I am going to prefect, it gives me a list on the left-hand side again of what I'll be getting. I think the Senia, where is this thing? Is here. And Jared will get something as well. But is your Yay! thing is full? I like getting things. Is your thing is full? I think probably not. No, not quite. Oh, maybe I shouldn't activate that then. <laughs> um, uh, this one here is Emilia. Emi? Where's Emilia on the left hand side? Yeah, that's a sort of brownish one. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, I see that now. Yeah, you. I don't have anything in there. Yeah, I know. Okay, let's get that. Sorry, Jared. Sorry. It's no, all fine. friendly. It's all friendly. <laughs> Uh, da, 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 da. Looking at that chart, what do I need? What do I need? I need a sneed. We need a sneed. Uh, Carl say I just look at the scores. I am a Yankees fan, but I'll keep it to myself for the evening. Okay. <laughs> we were trying to watch that when we are in New York, I think, but they were not playing. Taryn likes to watch uh, sports. I just say sports. I went to a Detroit. I went to a Detroit Tigers game. That's the only time I've been to baseball. Oh, oh nice. It 
was like weird. A, it was like yeah. people were playing a game and there were very few people watching it. It was mm. weird. How am I going to do I've got Diplomat and Mercator at the moment. I probably need to do Mercator because I've got no money. So I'm going to try to sell some of these. Like, unless if I want to buy some of those, as you can see. I think I will... Okay, I know what to do. I will sell this. Unless if I want to build somewhere good. Like those ones. I want to buy brick. I want to sell some wine. Sell. Like that. And I buy brick. That's that. That's it. Conservative. Cool. The chat is going. Yeah, I love nice. that the chat is has got a conversation. Tom has been wrong to, once, <laughs> but it was by road. <laughs> is it a dead joke? one. Hang on. Is it what they say? Um, there are many roads to Rome. There are many roads to Rome. Yeah, many roads to Rome. All, 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 all roads, roads lead to Rome. That's it. All yeah, roads lead to Rome. Old. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. But obviously, that's a lie. Like, how can I drive from Melbourne to Rome? <sighs> <laughs> it, at the time in the Roman Empire, it was true. That's it. Yeah. Ooh, diplomat. You diplomat. Yeah. Very good. I, I can't diplomat your diplomat, so I have to do tribune. <laughs> Let's do that. And then I can place a thing in the thing, which I will. You can place a colonist in the starting city. Oh no, it's going to be the boat again. That's okay. Yes, done. Okay. Well, quick game's a good game. What? Are you almost finishing it? Did you almost finish it? Oh my gosh, I just realized you have 12 out of 15. Okay, I'm definitely behind on this. Quick game, Mr. Quick game. Oh wow. Just doing, just doing, yeah. okay. doing my calculations. Jared almost wins, everybody. I'm totally happy if Jared wins. I actually. Slightly sad, but more happy because my guest is winning. Twelve out of fifteen. Nine. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I just went. Well done. I went. Wow. Get, get the bricks. Yeah. Get the bricks. <sighs> yep. And that just... is amazing. This is the last turn for me. So I think yep. the only thing I can do is purchase cards, everybody. Um, to try to uh, get more points. So, Mars is probably one good thing for me, but there is no Mars cards in there. Uh, looking at the point. Oh, Jupiter, actually. Jupiter is a good one. So, um, that is a seven point for me. So, I'll get Jupiter. And I will. How many Jupiters I can get? I can't get this Jupiter. I can only get Mercurius, which is five, which is not bad. Um, hmm. that is not good actually. I can't really get anything. I can only get one. Yeah. I think that's probably. Or I can get. I can build a co uh, some colonies over there. Um, you can see here. I've got. I can build. You know, some something in there maybe and that adds to my jupiter but that's probably is the best one okay i'm gonna do that then uh let's see move this guy over to here oh i can't even build it i can't even build it is not good. Or I can move this guy over here and I can build. Yeah. I'm pretty much done. 
I don't have yeah. enough stuff. Okay, that's that's okay. I will just buy cards with the and this. I'll get this one. And that's it. Um I can't afford to get two. Why is that? Additional cost at the bottom? Yeah. Oh uh let me try again. Purchased. I'll get this one. Console. And this one. Oh yeah, now now it let me. Okay, good. And that's it. Done. Well done, Jared. So let's see. End game. Sell Thank goods. You. So all of them are being sold and you get money and contributes to your points. And Jared won with What's that point? 113 to 94. Congratulations. Nice. That was a, that was a good game. You got quite game. A... Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, I tend to play games quick. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll try to remember that next time. Jared is a quick. Yeah. Do not. Okay. So uh, with that, um, that is basically Concordia Digital. Um, I'm yeah. going to remind everybody to enter before we draw, like in a few minutes, by putting this thing up. So go to mebleuniversity.com slash giveaway. And the password, all in capital, is Jared, which is our guest from 3 Minute Board Games. Um, enter, and then you will, uh, a, new, a new form, a form will reveal, just, um, fill out a simple form, and we'll draw very shortly. Um, <laughs> I like the conversation. Been to Italy. I have not been to Italy. <laughs> I was planning to go on my honeymoon to Essen and around Europe. That then COVID that happened, nice. and that didn't happen. So one day, one day, I'm sure. Um, all right. So, Jared, thank you so much. That was a good game. It was a great. Yeah, game thank you. Thank you for the game. Um, uh, I think any any game's a good game where you, you you don't end flipping tables, as I think someone on the chat said. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you can flip your screen, maybe, 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 <laughs> not, maybe not. You can just cross the cross that software. A good thing is about tabletop simulator is that you can flip the table digitally, digital table. Yeah. <laughs> my my friend Fraser, who's a who's a doctor, uh -huh. uh, didn't know that was possible, and then right at the end of a game, we were playing on Star Wars Rebellion because he was in quarantine. This is like a couple of years ago. He was in quarantine because he'd been. Um, near a patient that was quite infectious and he was just bored. Oh. So we played a full game of Star Wars Rebellion. At the end of the game, I flipped the table and he freaked. <laughs> <laughs> and like, and like absolutely shocked him. He's like, oh my God, what the hell was that? <laughs> oh, that's so hilarious. That is hilarious. Yeah. Oh, was... that's a fun moment there. Now he knows and then he kept flipping the table, I bet. And I was like, oh, look, yeah. wait, so if you miss it, I'll do it again. Rewind and just flip the table yeah. again. <laughs> The, the game was resolved and we're, we're all we're all um we're all done and finished but yeah, yeah okay. it's just before <laughs> of it was over off of course well you can even you can always like rewind it and then the table is unflipped anyways uh <laughs> don't forget about the secret ending lol yes so don't forget the secret ending <laughs> um i probably failed to mention to jared yes there's usually secret ending in our live playthrough like any other good marvel movies or any marvel okay. movies really mm. Uh, Hannah, you miss your honeymoon because of COVID? Yeah. Well, as long as we're together, like, our wedding was during yeah. COVID. Um, it's like, yeah, just do it. Like, with our family. My family, my family in Indonesia couldn't even make it because they just couldn't make it. And it's like, oh, should I wait for you? And my mom was like, no, nope, just do it. And then I ended up yeah. putting them on Skype. They all, like, dress up. And then it's like the phone is in the wedding. So I came there early to set up that, to set up the camera, to set up the microphone. <laughs> yeah we had um when we were at a level four we had um a friend who gave birth and like she couldn't have anyone around immediately after the baby was born it was just yeah it was real rough so oh, yeah. COVID, it's it's messed up a lot of lives mm -hmm. may may it be gone soon hopefully uh but i hey i can't complain i'm sure that there are other people that suffer more than me so oh, yeah. that's what I'm thinking and it will be better. So yay. Yeah. All right. I, yeah, yeah. I will draw this. I will draw this. All right, sir. I'm going to share you this one. 
can see we've got 26 entries today and from number well there are two number two but i'll if you see on my screen but the the first one i will count that as number one uh and so on so up to number 26 so let me go to that so we've got 26 and let's do this da, 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 da. i don't know if you can see this jared we got this ball of um, yeah all right the first one there are two winners so this is the first one and that is number 13 all right let me just switch to the other one well that's very very prophetic because my game red dust rebellion is number 13 in the coin series so 13 lucky number what do you mean your game like your game you you design a game yeah yeah. How come I don't know this? How do you not know this? How do I not know this? <laughs> <laughs> I, I feel so ashamed and embarrassed at the moment. I'm sure I've seen oh, it. I'm sure I've seen it, seen it and then say something. Uh, yeah. Ella's in it. I made like... Oh. I've put Ella in the game. She actually awesome. has like a character that's based on her. Oh, that's so. awesome. So I'm going to just quickly uh, go to that after this. So number 13 is S. Chiang. Congratulations. Congratulations! Yeah, people can see it. Let me just turn it off. Um, S. Chiang from Taiwan. I think I saw that before. Cool. Um, S. Chiang, congratulations. Do you want uh, a copy? So after this stream, please check your email. It might most probably go to the spam folder. So it will be there. So I'm going to write down uh, the winner. So I'll remember. So number 13. Lucky number 13. Okay, next is... Da, 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 da. Oh, it's number seven. I'm gonna guess it's number seven. You reckon? Okay. I'm guessing. Okay, let's see. It's number seven. Dun, dun, dun. It is number. I clicked it. I done it. <gasps> number three. Well, it's close. It's only. Well, that, that's even better. Yeah. Three for three minute board games. <laughs> exactly right. Wow. Wow. That is, this is totally your day. Um, all right. Here it is. The, the phone cast is back on. So number three is John Carson. Congratulations. You won a key, a Steam key to Concordia Digital. So again, please. Kappa uh, Good good stuff. Good stuff. All right. Uh, that's it, everybody. Um, I want to remind everybody to maybe stick around, maybe for secret ending, maybe not, where I torture Jared, Jared with my dead joke. Uh, but anyway, that's <laughs> it. Thank you so much, Jared. Jared is so excited about it. Uh, not. Jared, thank you so much for coming to my stream again. Yeah. Uh, Jared from 3 Minute Board Games, everybody. Give a clap. Uh, where can everyone and, find and, you? And also, designer of GMT's upcoming Smash It game, Red Dust Rebellion. Pre-order it on the GMT site now. We're nearly up to 2,000 pre-orders. Wow, really? I mean, yeah. wow. Okay, let me just like set up so that I can see that. Let me quickly do that while... Um... I'll flick you a link. Yes, please. Uh, where is this link going to be? I'll uh, just send it to you by Twits. By where? I'll send it oh, Twitter. Twitter? Okay, let me open Twitter. Because I don't have Twitter open... Because you don't want to be distracted. Da, 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 yeah, da, da. <laughs> like ping, like that. There we go. Okay, let's Sent. go to Twitter, and then I will show everybody. Finally, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. GM the game. That's awesome, Jared. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm sure is... I've seen it. I'm, I swear, I'm, I'm sure I've seen it before. Uh. Let me yeah, we're we're currently the second most pre-ordered game on GMT's pre-order site. So we're ahead of like um, the new version of Twilight Struggle, for example, Twilight Struggle wow. um, Africa. Yeah, yeah, and um, a whole bunch of other pretty well-established and well-known designers. Red um, dust. I swear I've seen it. Yeah, so I'm sure I've seen it. Uh, red dust rebellion. What did you tell me? I'm part of guff studios i publish games as well but not my design yeah. hmm. <laughs> I was like, oh, ah. this, this one's part of like a series so it kind of has to go with that publisher that's okay that's okay that's all right yeah and and it's still in pre-order it's not coming out until sometime next year Fingers right crossed. got you 
All right, I am going to stream this now so everybody can see Jared's lovely work. Um, let me find it. It is here. All right, there it is. Hopefully everyone can see that. And that is it, basically. That's Jared's... Wow, it's on special. Everyone just go buy it. <laughs> that, that's something GMT do. When you pre-order a game, they put it on uh, a discount. Okay. okay. So, yeah. yeah. That's, that's good strategy. And there you go. There is your video right there, uh, of course, which is very good. To, it's about uh, it's a war game with area majority, campaign battle, events, solo modes. Plays one to four players with complexity of four, age 10 and up, and plays 120 to 240 minutes. Everyone, please buy this game for Jared <laughs> and for yourself. Thank you. Thank you. And that's it, everybody. Uh, that's the end of it. And please stick around if you want me to see. Um, if you want to see, you get tortured. Or if, you, if you want to get tortured and be torturing Jared. But yep. until then, bye bye. Jared and a, a session of torturing thing. Well, Jared, if yeah. you have a dead joke, feel free to say it as well. And everyone is ready to guess. All right, here we go. Uh, I've seen this before. I don't. I'm not going to use. It. I'm using it for. Um, I'm, I'm using. I've used it before. I don't know if you heard it. What does a civilization in space use as a currency? I don't know. Speaking what does a civilization in space use as a currency? <laughs> Everyone knows we probably have heard this, but Jared hasn't. The answer is Starbucks. So we're talking about civilization jokes oh. because we have Concordia. Yes, see? Um, yeah. Dun, dun. Uh, it's terrible. <laughs> and what is, I know, what is the civilization's biggest scam in history? Capitalism. <laughs> but no, sorry. <laughs> What's the answer? <laughs> the Egyptians with the pyramid scheme. Oh. Uh... <laughs> like, you're right. You're right. These, these are terrible. <laughs> this is the best. This is like a chance of me seeing Jared's reaction. It's awesome. Yeah. This is like the best. All right. Um, here we go. What ancient civilization had the best canoers? This is related to Concordia. Well, the, the, the correct answer is the Polynesians. That is the correct answer. Well done, but this is not the correct answer. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the the non-correct answer is the Romans. Roman. Oh. <laughs> Oh, oh, I, love, oh, I love that expression. Oh, this is why I take Jared here to just <laughs> tell him some bad, horrible dead it's jokes. Terrible. Yes. Um, Be ashamed. Well, you you come up with something then. <laughs> you. <laughs> uh, one more, maybe, maybe not. But I love that one. I like to, I like to close it with that one. <laughs> um. All right. Can I find? Oh, come on, Google. Can Google give me a better one than that? I guess not. That's probably is a, a good one. Oh, oh, this one. That's not a joke. That's a history. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a joke. That's just racism. <laughs> that is just history. Okay. What? This is the last one. Okay. What did yep. ancient Greeks call a pair of glasses? I don't know. What did ancient <laughs> Greeks call a pair of glasses? <laughs> Spectacles. No? Oh. Yeah. I, Spectacles. Yeah. Spe Spectacles. 
Spectacles. I think I think you'd have to pronounce it spectacles. Spectacles. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very yeah. much. Spectacles. Uh, that's it. That's it, everybody. Thank you so much again, once again, Jared, for being here. Yep. You're like <laughs> I'm putting up with that. <laughs> You're putting up with that. Ding, ding. Thank you, everyone. And if you are around this Saturday morning or Friday evening, we are hosting a live play of Welcome to. And on Sunday morning, aka uh, Australia time, aka Saturday evening, US Canada time, is we playing something. <laughs> Magic Horror 2. That's it. That's it. All right. Bye, everybody. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Yara. Kia ora. That's it. I get it right. <laughs> right? No? Yes. Uh, yeah, kia ora is like um, kia ora. basically hi. Hi. Kia ora. Hi. Bye. But it's also. It also it's something you can say when, uh, like, almost like cheers as well. Oh, yeah. So if someone, uh, you go, oh, can you pass me the salt? And they pass you the salt, you go, kia ora. Kia ora. So okay. it can be, yeah. I love it. Yeah, it can be done that way as well. So it's, um, yeah, it's a greeting and it's also a sort of, yep. Uh, and before cool. we, oh, that's cool. Oh, before we go, I missed it, the not shelf. How can you tell the difference between an alligator and crocodile? crocodile? One will see you later and one will see you after a while. Oh. <laughs> okay, one more. I promise. Carl said, when an ancient civilization carved the first wheel out of stone, they simultaneously invented rock and roll. Ding, 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 ding. ding. Okay, that's it. Bye, everyone. Thank you so much.